We want to talk more about this new coronavirus variant and the vaccine rollout with Dr. Ashish Jha, the dean of Brown University School of Public Health. Dr. Jha, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, first, we want to get to this new evidence. There is no new evidence, rather, that this new strain uh, is more severe. So what more do we know at this point? Yeah, good morning. Thank you for having me on. You know, what we know right now is that it does look like this strain is more contagious. That means if you're exposed to it, you're more likely to get infected uh, than other strains. And I agree with Dr. Gottlieb from the last report that it probably is already in the U.S., uh, but there's nothing that tells us that it's any more severe, uh, and that is good news. And so at least we can res feel reassured about that so far, based on what we know. So to that point about it already being in the U.S., do you agree with New York Governor Andrew Cuomo? He's among uh, a few people who are calling for a, a ban on travel from the U.K. Do you think that that makes a difference right now? Would that help? Yeah, so what we know about travel bans is it can slow spread by a couple of weeks. Uh, so it might give us a little bit more time to prepare. Uh, I like what Governor Cuomo is doing on uh, asking airlines to test people before they get on the plane. That feels pretty reasonable. I, I don't think a travel ban will keep that strain out of the U.S., but it certainly might slow things down by a little bit. And with us seeing these new changes and these new variants with this, um, this type of uh, infection, do you think that we're going to have to modify the vaccines as it changes? You know, so these kinds of variations do happen, and whether we're going to end up needing, let's say, a year or two down the road to uh, change our vaccines, we don't know right now. Uh, it is possible. I think we should be ready for that, that a bit down the road that might happen. But I'm not worried that the current vaccines we have will somehow become ineffective against this variant. Uh, that seems much less likely to me. Christmas travel is already outpacing Thanksgiving. Uh, we know that we're telling people try not to travel, but people are getting on planes, trains, driving to see grandma, if you will. Uh, what is your concern and, again, best advice if you are going to travel? Yeah, you know, I totally get it, right? I, we always get together during the holidays with our family. We're not doing it this year. Uh, my advice is if you can avoid it, please do. If you can't, keep it small. Try to wear masks, especially around vulnerable people. Uh, stay safe because vaccines are so close. We want to make sure everybody's safe through the holidays uh, so they can get vaccinated and get back to normal next year. All right, Dr. Ashish Jha, always great to see you. Thank you. Thank you.